as a pediatric rheumatologist uh, i commonly prescribe steroids or what we call corticosteroids uh, to my patients now the basic question here is are steroids safe in children to answer this question i will have to take you to two important cases the first case is a 4 year old girl who came to me 3 months back with high grade fever rashes and joint swelling she had a rheumatic condition called systemic gia and within a week of presentation her platelet count started dropping her ferritins rose to more than 1 lakh she was diagnosed to have a very serious condition called macrophage activation syndrome wherein a hyperactive immune system starts destroying our own blood cells this is what we call the macrophage activation syndrome we quickly started steroids in this child and the girl recovered in the next 5 days now if we hadn't started steroids this would be a fatal situation so steroids can be life saving in such situations now let me go to case number 2 last month when i visited hyderabad at my monthly visits i saw a 2 year old child who had ongoing fevers for last 3 to 4 months she also reported back pain and she was not able to walk normally there was no joint swelling and suspecting that there is some rheumatic condition this child was started on steroids very empirically when i reviewed the records this child had persistent lymphocytosis most of the hemograms showed high lymphocyte count and low neutrophil counts i quickly stopped steroids got a bone marrow examination done and this child was diagnosed to have a blood cancer acute leukemia now where did things go wrong starting steroids empirically without a clear diagnosis in a young child can be devastating so friends with these two cases i would like to highlight that like any other medicine steroids have their own pros and cons if used judiciously they can save lives if not they can lead to havoc thank you